I brought my nephew here with me for support. And uh, what, how do you think I'm going to do out there? Do you think I'm going to be the best? Okay. Uh, I don't know. Forgive me, Jake. Don't tell me to. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> You're going in. You're so going in. <laughs> You're going in, Holly. <laughs> Hi everyone, you're watching the Tom Harris Chevrolet Locker Room right here on Shaw TV. I'm your host, Extreme Joe. And I'm your co-host, Holly Robinson. And for today's show, Joe and I thought we would show our support to Nanaimo's biggest event of the year. That's right, Holly, we're here at Departure Bay and we're going to be doing the Media Challenge bathtub race. A lot of you might not know this, like we didn't beforehand, but there's actually a bathtub circuit that goes on throughout the summer, throughout the island. So there's going to be two professional races and then our Media Challenge. That's right. Now, for, for those of you at home, Holly will be the one competing in today's race. Yes. I will be her coach. That's right. And we plan to win. We plan to win, of course. We always plan to win. But yes. it's not about competition, Holly. It's about having fun. Even today, Joe? Even today. Now, Holly, did you actually have a chance to prepare for this race? Oh, yeah. I was out earlier this week getting ready and getting used to the water. Well, let's check it out. So we've got my boat being entered into the water. Well, actually, it's Mark's boat. So thank you, Mark, for letting me ride your boat. I promise I will not break it. We're going for the practice run tonight, Wednesday night, before our big race on Sunday. So wish me luck, everybody. And Todd says I don't need a wetsuit. I should be fine. There's people swimming here. I should be fine. This one doesn't have any steering or anything, it has a tiller armor on the back. So all that changes is your back more in the back of the tub, which is better anyways because you want less tub in the water. The more tub in the water, the more drag you have, the more speed you lose. Just keep right to the back as much as you can and just keep the throttle on full. Excellent start. She gave it lots of gas and moved to the front of the boat like I told her to get it up on plane. She had an excellent start. Looks like she's a born tubber. Mark's machine is definitely a fast tub and so it was so much fun. It is a beautiful night and all I could think out there was I love coming to work. I just love coming to work on this show. Thank you everybody. Fantastic. She's a natural out there in that tub. I think you guys should get a tub for her to race all the time. She did really good. She kept her body weight to the back of the tub and kept most of the tub out of the water. She did an excellent job. She's light enough, and I think she'll do really good coming to the media race. I'm hoping for a first place finish for her. Well, you know, Holly's going to have a late breaking injury, so. <laughs> These media people. You know, you've seen the paparazzi. The crazy, crazy people. So Holly, uh, that looks pretty fun, but uh, you know. It's looking rough out there, Joe. It's pretty rough out there, I'd have to say. Yeah, and I don't really want to get a big beating out there in the water, so I'm you know, a little nervous. You know what we should do, though? We should find out how the other media feels. Yeah, let's, let's, see. let's see if we can psych them out. Yeah. Uh, a lot of people think that there's only one big race of the year, which is true. We have the, uh, the great race uh, in the third week of July every year, uh, but there's also another eight races throughout the year where we accumulate those points for the World Cup points. Uh, three different classes, they're super modified, modified and stock, and the leaders in each one of those classes uh, vie for the trophies in each class. So, so Alison, uh, the weather's pretty crappy out here, how do you feel? I'm a little nervous, yeah. you know, seeing the boats fly and stuff like that. I could tell you, know? you were nervous, yeah. 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 It wasn't like this when we practiced on the lake. No, no. It wasn't yeah. quite the same, was it? No, it really wasn't. So Danielle, it's really, really windy out here, kind of cold. How do you feel? Yeah, I'm a bit nervous too. My strategy was going for flat water, but that's obviously not happening. Uh, well, you, you can see I'm double padded, so, you know, I'm warming up, but it's, uh, it's pretty 
like intense out there, so I'm yeah. hoping to not like fall out of the tub. Yeah. That's sort of what I've got my fingers crossed for. These guys have done really well. I don't know how well we're gonna do. I don't know how experienced you are. I've been out uh, twice on the water, so it's uh, yeah, it's chancy. It's pretty choppy out there. The circuit races I have lots of fun with because you're in the heat of the race at all times. You can see who's in front of you and you can see who's behind you. So that gives you that advantage of wanting to uh, pass that person or cut the other person off maybe, I don't know. <laughs> but it's just you're right there feeling every minute of the races in the circuit races. So I enjoy that more than the big ones. There's not one guy out there that doesn't want to win, but at the same point, uh, we're all out there for one reason, and that's to have a lot of fun. I've got exactly three minutes, no, nah, let's say eight minutes of bathtub time. Eight minutes. I think I've got a good 20, so that's good. Gives you an edge. An edge. They call me Edgy Holly. No, not really. I'm joking. That was a big finish. I'm glad to see that uh, that nice woman right there came very close to coming first place in the stock race. Uh, she was seconds away. She bailed out of that boat with no fear at all, ready to run up to that beach. And uh, boy, it's a windy day out here, let me tell you. It's really windy, really rough. It was sort of reminding me of last year's big race. It's pretty crazy out there, though. As soon as you turn around that one corner and hit straight into the waves, wind blows you right up in the air. Now, uh, would you say that danger is a pretty big factor in this too? Like, uh, is it pretty dangerous out there for our media? It is. Yeah. It's a little dangerous. They're just going to have to take their time. It's looking really rough out there, and especially when all the boats get in the same concentrated area, the water can get quite choppy in there. So, you know, I'm a little nervous, but my competitors are nervous too, so maybe that's a good thing. Uh, they say there's no difference between nervous and excited, so maybe I'm just excited about the choppy water. Keep in mind, too, that you said that you have a big, uh, you, have, you have a lot of confidence in yourself because you're used to the water. So maybe there's some, some media people out there who aren't so used to the water. Thanks, coach. See, that's why Joe's my that's coach. That's why I'm the coach. He pumps me up. Coach Extreme. Holly, well, I think it's safe to say that the media race has been cancelled. Or at least postponed. Hopefully we can do it another day with a little better weather. But that's part of the island life, isn't it, Joe? Yeah. So... Back to the office. What are we going to do for a show? Hey, Joe! Do you want to make this a competition? Sure, Holly. Okay, three! She's going to cheat. Two! I'm going to get hurt. One! Oh man. Go! Joe. Yeah. I mean, even though you lost, I mean, that was fun, eh? <sighs> okay, Holly. You won. Thanks. Come on in, though, Joe. Seriously. So, Holly, wrap another one up. It was a good show today. It was a great show, and at least we had a little challenge at the end, and That's I managed right. to beat you in the bathtub here, the hot tub. This is a hot tub, actually. But, you know, same idea. Yeah, totally. Race. Yeah, no, that's cool. You, get you know, we didn't actually get to do the media race today. No, I guess the thunder and lightning scared us off. Yeah. And the rolling waves. And the hurricane force winds. That's right. It, it, was, it was definitely, definitely an interesting show. We've never really been turned away from a show before with the weather but uh, you know today was a definitely interesting yeah one. it wasn't safe for us to go out there so I think they made the right call but you should you should be able to catch the media race eventually I'm sure they're gonna reschedule it we also will. they've got a lot of circuits and stuff coming up before the actual big race That's on July right. 21st so 22nd 22nd, sorry. 22nd is the big Nanaimo bathtub race and if you want to catch a different race they have a circuit going on along the island and it's any time in the summer so look at their web page and maybe you can catch a race near you also if you guys have any comments questions suggestions or show ideas for us Make sure to give us a call, 760-1987, or email us on anamotv at shaw.ca. If you want to see this show or any other one, you can go online to lockerroom.shawtv.com. Right, once again, for the Tom Harris Show with the Locker Room, I'm Extreme Joe. And I'm Holly Robinson. We'll see you next time. That's right, and if you guys have any comments, please... For today's show, Joe... And... Yeah.
What was that? <laughs> Joe thought. Joe thought. <laughs> for today's show, Joe thought we'd be here. Along the lo island. Oh, sorry. That was her, not me. Just you know. I hope you're all keeping track at home. Hi everyone, you're watching the town. Blah, 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 blah. I was just practicing my words beforehand. This is my kind of bathtubbing. I think this is really what they meant by bathtubbing. You have baths in this thing? Why not? <laughs> Could you get the gunk out for Sid? <laughs>